Hey guys, welcome to a days in my life vlog. I'm currently in Vancouver. I just got in last night. You probably don't know this, but I am originally from Vancouver. I was born and raised here, lived here most of my life. It's been about a year and a half since the last time I was here. And it just feels like very kind of nostalgic. One, because I'm in my old bedroom at my parents' place. So I'm gonna be spending the week here. It's currently Friday. I got in around like 10 last night. So it was kind of late, feeling a little bit of jet lag, but that's okay. I don't I don't really have anything crazy planned i think because i'm from vancouver the main reason i did want to come back is honestly just to see my family my friends chill out i have most of the days off so i really get to decompress and relax and then i do work a couple days remotely so i'll show you how that goes i'm also really happy that it's not raining if you've heard anything about vancouver you probably know it is notoriously terrible for the rain which is one of the primary reasons why i left to be very honest but so far are so good. I'll be here until the following Sunday, which is just over a week. Excited to share just how the days kind of go. I'll check in with you guys later and of course show you anything that I get up to. So enjoy this vlog and I'll see you guys in a little bit. It's so nice to have a backyard and space to go outside, especially since I'm so used to being in a condo. So I'm just going for a walk around the neighborhood and honestly, I'm pretty cold, which is kind of funny because people think that being in Ontario, it would be much colder, but for some reason, it's a different type of cold here. I feel like it actually, it's like cold in my bones. Mind you, it's April right now, so it really shouldn't be cold, but I'm literally in a puffy jacket. Hey guys, so it is Saturday. I just got home. We went to a tulip festival in Chilliwack. So Chilliwack is a bit further out from like the Vancouver, greater Vancouver area. I'll insert some clips here, but it was like the perfect weather when we got there. It's basically just a bunch of tulips and daffodils, which were really pretty. And we got some moments of sunshine, which were really nice and just nice to get out. After that, we ended up getting just a bite to eat at Earl's on the way home. We stopped at a garden store, so my mom was a huge gardener and she just wanted us to take a peek, so we walked around. So it's been a nice day. I'm actually just in the middle of getting ready. I'm heading over to a friend's place. I'm finally getting to see his and his fiance's place, so they're having me over for dinner. I'm just gonna do a quick little outfit change and then head over there for dinner. I'm in the bathroom, just in case you're wondering, because I was about to get ready and just like figure myself out, but then I realized I should probably just stop in and say hi. So with that, I'm gonna get back to it and get myself ready for dinner. <laughs> So we're back in the bathroom. I'm about to head out just to meet a friend. I think we're just gonna get a coffee or something. And then after that, I kind of want to go downtown or just like shopping somewhere. So I'll take you along for that. But it's a pretty simple look today. Did my hair with a flat iron. I know, right? Tell me more. But I usually don't use a flat iron and it was my first time. This is like three day old hair. So I'm feeling good about it. So I'm gonna head out now and I will see you in a little bit.
right there. And I remember smoking cigarettes over here five years ago. Just crazy. So the weather is pretty tragic today. It's honestly what I would have expected this whole time that I've been here. So I can't really complain, but it's raining quite a bit. It's just been a chill day indoors. We're actually gonna go head out to the movies. Something I know my mom really likes to do, but she doesn't do it often. We're gonna see everything everywhere all at once. It is with Michelle Yeoh, I think that's how you pronounce her name, who was in Crazy Rich Asian. She's a pretty big name and it looks amazing. The reviews were really good. And then I think the rest of the day, we're gonna have some hot pot tonight. Just trying to make the best use out of this weather. What can you do? Typical Vancouver. It is now Wednesday. I haven't checked in in a little bit just because honestly I've been enjoying myself, enjoying catching up with people, spending time with family, and it's just been really, really nice and relaxing. Today we went to Capilano Suspension Bridge. I remember going there like growing up and it wasn't as expensive back then, but I haven't been in years and it was a really nice walk around. I am so scared. Shaking. It's actually shaking. Tree top adventures. This is a shark or a It's both. Oh. Um, it's okay. Why? If you need a better one for your work, I don't need it for my work. It's just for personal. Eight foot. It is shaking so much. I would recommend it. I feel like people that live here locally are probably like, that's ridiculous to have to pay to go there, but I did enjoy it. I'm gonna make dinner for my parents, which I haven't done yet since I got back. I'm back online slash back to work tomorrow. I'm working Thursday and Friday. I will try to share how that goes. I've done it here before and it hasn't been too much of a hassle, but it is a little bit of an adjustment because it's so much earlier in the day. So I'll share how that goes, but otherwise just gonna enjoy the evening. I 
it is currently 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time where I'm currently, it is actually 9 a.m. which means I've been working since 6 a.m. I got up around 5.30 which was a joy. Just kidding, it obviously wasn't. I am not a morning person. If I could sleep in every day, I totally would. Yeah, it's taken a while for the coffee to kick in. I've had two cups now. I'm probably gonna go for a third if I'm being honest. It's not too, too bad. It's kind of like a mind fuck to look at my computer which is set to Toronto time and then look at my phone which is Vancouver time and then I'm just like, oh my god i don't know where i am but getting through it it was totally my decision to work remotely because like i had to get approval to do so but i just wanted to at least have a couple days because of just everything that's going on but my manager had asked me like are you sure you don't want to just take the time off and i was like no it's gonna be fine it's just two days and i'm very glad that it's just two days i'm like do i eat lunch now because it's 12. I don't know how much else I'm going to share. I've had one meeting today. I was supposed to have another one. It got cancelled and I'm just trying to get through some reporting and some emails I need to still respond to from me being away. So yeah, I'll just continue with this. If anything eventful happens, I will let you know. I'm currently just packing up so I'm leaving back home to Toronto this evening it's been a really good trip I didn't vlog too much over the last few days because I was honestly just hanging out I think that's been the theme of this whole trip I'm glad that I got to do a couple more interesting things that I got to share with you guys but overall like I said at the beginning this has just been a nice time to come back and visit home I am excited to go back to Toronto but also going to miss being here and just being on vacation so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more and I will see you next time.